Hello, this is Marcia Pico, and I'm going to tell you a poem today that I wrote called Never Parted From Joy. They say, gone but not forgotten, but there's more that is really true. When a loved one, friend or stranger says goodbye to you, we weep and mourn and feel sorrow, longing for their safety and presence to be. But your loved one, friend or stranger, never parted from you. Actually, in their joy, they express love, the only thing that has ever been true. And whether you realize it or not, their expression of life is a part of you. And just like a drop of water, the quality never parted from the sea, nor a ray of sunshine from the sun, its ray expresses nothing differently. So your loved one, friend or stranger, their joy remains, you see, at one with our loving Creator, carved in your heart permanently. When our loved ones pass on, it can be hard. Mary Baker Eddy writes, the poor suffering heart needs its rightful nutriment, such as peace, patience in tribulation, and a priceless sense of the dear Father's loving kindness. Christ Jesus taught the Beatitudes in his Sermon on the Mount, and one of them is, Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. To want to progress is as natural as a flower turns toward the light. Our natural inclination is to want good. Experiencing sorrow or pain, we can find truth in this question asked by Eddie. Who that has felt the loss of human peace has not gained stronger desires for spiritual joy. The aspiration after heavenly good comes even before we discover what belongs to wisdom and love. Let's remember, love heals us.